Yo, 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 what's good? Homies at home ass. We're gonna get ready to get into this video called Shacked Up Full, Greatest Flop in NBA History by NBA on TNT. And you know what? I reacted to a video a few days ago called NBA, Best NBA Fights of 2016-2017 um, NBA Season. Marcus Smart was in a few of them. Marcus Smart is on the thumbnail of this. I was like, hey, I have to react to it. I have to check it out. I have to see what he did. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed the video. Remember to smash that like button, leave a comment, subscribe, share, follow me on Twitter at RC underscore reacts. Follow me on Instagram at RC reacts. I'm not going to waste any more time, Jaw Jack, and we're going to go ahead and hop to this video right now. Can't wait. Let's check it out. Best of NBA Shaq and Fool. Look at, look at Shaquille and Yon acting full. <laughs> this guy right here. <laughs> okay. Okay, look at him. Presented by Hotels.com. Of course, LeBron James. He is one of the best floppers in NBA history. <laughs> wow. Yeah, he had look at him like, what was that? No. That was a pal. There's that um Patrick Beverly. He was in the fight compilation too. You can't. Do, I think this. You can't do that, really. And since I see him run on the weekends, get ready to do. You can't. Even he shook his hair. I think Patrick Beverly is like one of the biggest trolls in the NBA right now. And I think he just does a lot of stuff for a hell of it because he know he won't get punished for a lot of things. He just troll everybody all the time. Like, really. He's at the um free throw line. Who really does something like that? I haven't seen that in NBA before. I haven't that's the first time I've seen something like that. That's like, just that really mm. his his Patrick his Beverly is just he is something. <laughs> he really three, is. Donatas Monte Junis. He, he I never heard this guy, and, and that name is just super difficult oh to pronounce. Oh. Is this going to be a Shaq and Rocket movement? Uh, movement? Probably. Who I mean, knows? It's hot, it's hot, it's hot, it's hot. <laughs> that is crazy, though. If another Rocket is on the Shaq and Fool, I'm leaving. Number four, Marcus Smart. Marcus Smart, of course he's on here. Look at that. He looked like he just got tackled in a football game. He looked like he got shot. He really did. Looks like he either got choke slammed like that. He looked like he got choke slammed by the big show. He looked like he got tackled by a football player and he looked like he got shot. One of the three. This actually happened in a Greek league game. I saw this, man. Yeah. Greek league game? I, I didn't even know Greek really had the NBA, to be honest. Oh, that was nice. And they nice. lost the game. Yeah. Oh, lost the time. Time. Did he score for the wrong team? You know what I'm thinking, Kenny? What are you thinking? He going to be on the Rockets by the end of the week? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, <laughs> what happened? Did he score? The Rockets by the end of the week. <laughs> I think he scored for the wrong team. I'm not sure, but he realized what he did. I think he really vote for your favorite. I'm going to say last guy. That's what I'm going to say, because if he scored for the wrong team, that was the most dipshit thing. That, that was the stupidest thing you could do. You're going to score a basket for the opposing team and cause your team to lose. And after that, he stood there like... Like, he, he just, like, he was in shock. I have to say it's either him or Marcus Smart, one of the two that I'm choosing, because that was just boneheaded right there. No, not even Marcus Smart, because Marcus Smart, even though he's over dramatic, I have to say Patrick Beverly, because I've never seen somebody, when they're at the free throw line, try to make a shot, I've never seen somebody try to take the ball from him and just smack. I think he's just being a troll sometimes. That's just my opinion. But who do you pick? Leave your pick down in the comment section below. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed my reaction and the video. Remember to smash that like button, leave a comment, subscribe, share. Until next time, it's your boy RC signing off. Much love. Peace.